This is a 16 gallon drum that I bought for water storage. I've done a video about this several months ago, but instead of just talking about it, I want to show you all some of the stuff that we use to treat the water. They're going to be using this Aquamara water treatment. A lot of people use bleach for their water treatment, but that can leave an undesirable taste in the water. So we're going to try this and see how well it works out. This drum was cleaned with just regular dish soap. What, what was in it was a concentration of Dr. Pepper syrup. So whenever I first got it, it you opened the caps and smelled inside of it and it smelled like Dr. Pepper. And so I took and washed it out, just took a water hose in it, squirted a little bit of uh, like dishwashing liquid inside of there and stuck the hose in it, let it run, filled it, well I filled it up, let it sit for like an hour or two then stuck the hose in it, flushed it out, poured all that water out, filled it up again, and repeated the cycle with, until there was no more smell of dishwashing soap. The instructions say to use one teaspoon of A and B. These are labeled A and B. And one teaspoon for every five gallons of water. So we're gonna put 15 gallons inside that drum out there. So we're gonna need three teaspoons of each one of these mixed into a can or a cup and then poured inside of it. To shake it up really good, what I'm doing while it's running, make sure that I hose it down inside there and just kind of shake it up. There. The instructions say to let it sit, let the drum sit anywhere from 15 to 30 minutes if the water is very cold, to let it sit for 30 minutes. So I'm just going to let it sit here with the cap off of it and in about 30 minutes I'm going to come back and put the cap on and put it in the shed.